We're gonna go over some rotator cuff exercises now. So some internal and external rotation. Peyton's gonna be my example here. One key thing to mention with when you're doing these exercises is when we're doing them down here at zero degrees abduction, which is kind of where we start, you really wanna be sure that we keep our elbow at our side and we're not coming up into these positions, any abduction at all. So what, what I like to do is have a folded up towel or a pillow, something for somebody to kind of squeeze in between their elbow and their side. So you can go ahead and squeeze that, turn your body around, and we're just gonna grab one of these bands. She's gonna keep her elbow at her side, about 45 degrees external rotation. You're just gonna pull all the way into your stomach, hold for four or five seconds. Good, and then slowly back up. Go ahead and go in. Hold for four or five seconds. Slowly back out. Just really focus on slowly coming back out. It's perfect. So go ahead and maintain this same posture, turning your body 180 degrees. Now we're gonna do the same thing, working on external rotation. So I like to kind of have my thumb up, pulling straight out, holding four or five seconds, then really nice and slow in towards the stomach. All the way out. Perfect. To kind of put you in a little more sport specific or vulnerable position to strengthen, you wanna do some of the same exercises up here at about 90 degrees abduction. So Peyton, if you wanna go ahead and grab that yellow band. And take maybe one step out. So the key thing with her, and she's in perfect <laughs> posture, you want to be stopped nice and tall. Again, your shoulder's gonna be at about 90 degrees abduction, elbows about 90 degrees flex. So you just wanna think about everything being nice and square. Then she's gonna keep everything square here and go ahead and rotate all the way down, holding for four or five seconds and back up. A lot of times people will tend to cheat on themselves and kind of pull their shoulder forward, pull their shoulder backward. Just keeping it in a good position, coming straight down is perfect. Back up, good. And same thing now, that's your internal rotation. So we're gonna go ahead and turn 180 degrees. We're gonna work on external rotation up here at 90 degrees abduction. Let's go ahead and externally rotate, hold four or five seconds, that's the hardest part. Slowly back down. She's keeping her shoulder nice and square. Go ahead and pull out. Go ahead and relax. Good. 